Hello everybody and welcome back to He Makes Me Play. I am Marius and I am blind. I cannot see video games, therefore I make other people play games. And sometimes I teach them games too. <laughs> like today. Hello Renee. Hello, Marius. Welcome back to our course in NetHack. <laughs> Thank you very much, Senpai. I'm, I'm very glad to be here and in this authoritative position uh, <laughs> as one of the only places in my life where I have authority. Um, let's get into it. I think last time, well, we kind of stumbled around the mines and yeah, we found we got that stuck, yeah. yeah, there's a very tight passage <laughs> um, and we did a bunch of curse identifying and stuff, mm -hmm. sort of normal stuff. Today, I think we're, we, we found the Oracle. Yeah. Our goal is to get into Zokoban and finish Zokoban, I think. Okay. And I hope you like puzzles, <laughs> <laughs> you and the viewers, because <laughs> if we get to Zokoban, there will be a bit of puzzling. Okay, yeah. Yeah, but um, for now, let's explore the Oracle level, I'd say. Yeah, we're on dungeon level 6 still yeah. with the Oracle. There's... Ah, I've, do, I don't remember, have we move. already found the actual Oracle? Yeah, we have, yeah. Okay. And we, I think we asked uh, asked it already with something, yeah. Yeah, I mean, it, we, ha we did that whole thing, yeah, yeah. We don't need to interact with her anymore. Unfortunately, nowadays, she's not very interesting. I see here a little dog corpse. That's Shall not eat? ours. No. No, 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 do not eat that no. dog corpse. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, the large yeah. dog eats the little dog corpse. A viewer has recently uh, corrected uh, what was wrong with our assessment of eating the dog in a couple episodes ago, but I will not go into the details here because it's a long discussion, uh, and I think I might have already mentioned it. But what I will so do... So we are not allowed to eat dog corpses anymore. In general, don't eat dogs and kittens. Okay. You'll get aggravate monster. But, but our dog is allowed to eat dogs and kittens? Yeah, he can do whatever okay, he wants. because he just... Do not limit it. your dog. Uh, I was just going to say, uh, please, dear viewers, if you want more corrections, uh, please give them to us. I think what I'm going to do is just accumulate them, and then eventually in some episode I'll go through all of them. Mm. I think that sounds good. Do you agree? So even the master can learn something. That oh, is, absolutely. That is, I get shit that wrong is all the time. the real lesson here, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, the lesson is learning by doing. So let's do some stuff. Can we smash statues? Okay, wait. There's uh, something standing in front of us. A bugbear. But I oh, killed okay. it with one. Shall I eat that? Is it a corpse? Yeah. Um, what, what kind of question is that? Yeah, sure. <laughs> I think eating bugbear is fine. I was confused because I thought, oh, is it an actual beer? Ooh, bleach, what in food? You finish eating the bugbear corpse. Oh, okay. It wasn't so good. No. Um, but I think this doesn't kill you. Oh, there's something laying around. Nice. Elf, 11 darts. <laughs> Is it a dart? <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> uh, okay. Pick them up, right? Uh, I don't know. Oh. We have darts already. And we have little trouble lifting. Yeah, just drop them. We have. We, I think we are really at the at the uh, corner of our uh, no at the uh, how do you say at the at the limit of our weight. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Um, we don't want to run around burdened for sure, but I mean, the easiest thing now is to drop the darts. How many? Well, is it all in one stack? Yeah, we have 17. Oh, okay. Uh, I think I would drop like 12, and I forgot how to do that. I think you can like... Yeah, how do you do that? Drop G. You drop 17 darts. Yeah, yeah but we don't want them. that. <laughs> I think if you hit N and then a number... N. And and then maybe pick up, it will um, pick up that number of darts. But I'm not sure. Okay, so I drop them again. And or you, you N. No, N doesn't do anything. It. I don't think it gives you a message. Oh, N10. Yeah. Count 10. Yes. And then comma. Unknown command. Comma is unknown command. Well, then Oh, then comma. N10, comma. You have a little lifting trouble, a little trouble lifting ten darts. Okay, it worked, but uh, not. Then do the N and drop five. Just, let's just very, uh, run around with five darts. That's okay. fine. N drop. No. N and then five and then oh, drop. Oh, that's really uh, N five drop. You talk G. like someone who's you never used Vim before. <laughs> you drop ten darts. <laughs> no, that you, didn't work. Well, then do the picking up. That worked, right? N, just pick up five. Okay. I don't want to drop anything. N5 pick up. Five darts. Nice. Okay. Yeah. And we're not burdened. And I see a brown potion. No, we're not burdened. Okay. I pick uh, up the brown potion. You can leave it laying around oh. and let, see if the pet steps on it. Oh, and we are burdened again. Oh. Because of the I think we have to take a quick look at our inventory and get rid of some useless uh, crap. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Shall I shall I read to you what we have? Please do also as a reminder. Okay. We have 17 gold pieces. Yeah. The blessed wasp proof plus one Excalibur. That's cool. A plus zero dagger. 
Ja. Five Darts. Ja. A Poisoned Dart. Right. An, an Elven Dagger. Ja. Um, a Blessed Plus Three Small Shield. Right. A Plus Zero bear, A Pair of Iron Shoes. Yeah, we're wearing that, right? Yeah. yeah. Uh, a plus zero splint mail, we're wearing that. A plus zero all skin cloak, we're wearing that. A plus zero orcish helm, we're wearing that. A carrot. All a, right. A scroll of identify. Mm. A scroll labeled Etaroin Schrittlu, named uncursed. Right. Uh, another uh, scroll labeled Etaroin Schrittlu, uh, not named anything. A scroll labeled Je vor Brüderne. So, a bunch of course. unidentified scrolls. Let's leave it at that. <laughs> yeah. Um, then we have one, two, three, four, five, six potions. Yeah. And um, uh, where two are unident uh, unidentified. Mm -hmm. One is cursed, the other uncursed. Um, a wand of locking, a zinc wand named uncursed, a uranium wand named uncursed, wand of, wand of magic missile. Right. A looking glass named uncursed. Um, a tinning kit. Yeah. Um, and then a yellowish brown gem, two violet gems, a green gem, and two black gems. Uh, it's not, not great candidates for dropping. The thing is, our armor is very heavy. Yeah, but it's, it gives us uh, everything. I know. It gives us. And something. we, yeah. But I guess, for example, the orcish helm, maybe that's very heavy. I don't know. No, or there's the nothing shoes. in the armor that we, we should part with. AC is just too important. Okay. Um, I'd say drop more darts, honestly. We have the daggers as well. We could drop a dagger, but I like to keep them around in case we um, have to engrave Albereth. Yeah. Um, although, I guess... No, we don't really... We don't know if we have a wand that can do that. Um, actually, we know we I don't wished. have one. So I would just, maybe at this point, drop all the darts. Okay, I dropped all the darts. We only have one poison dart left. Should we I can ke keep that one and yeah. the two daggers. But we are still burdened. We are st what the fuck? The, br the brownish... Uh, oh, the, did you pick up the potion? Yeah. All right. Um, by the way, how many food rations or anything do we have? Only a carrot. Only a carrot? Jesus. Okay, uh, let's look at the potions. Maybe we have to do some stuff with them. <laughs> okay, okay. We have a brown potion. Yeah. A sky blue potion named Cursed, a white potion named Cursed, uh, Uncursed, a black potion named Uncursed, a puce potion, and a clear potion named Uncursed. Man, they're all unidentified. We have no idea what these potions are. But we can use our scroll of Identified to use it on the potions. Yeah, that's an idea. We could. But then, you know, we use that scroll. Yeah, but it gives us some room. But you don't know if that will give you room. Like, I mean, it might be useful potions that we don't want to go. Oh yeah. Of. I think um we we just drop some stuff here because we're on our way to Zokoban. We'll be picking up more stuff. Um and we're coming back, but won't like well, somebody hopefully steal we'll, them? No, that doesn't happen. No? Oh, I mean really? yeah it happens when you're on the level. It can absolutely happen that monsters will pick up those potions and use them against you. But I don't really have a better idea. I mean we could find the upstairs to Zokoban and then um, then drop, drop them there. Yeah. And okay, when we so come we back the... down, we pick them up again. So right now, just drop the brown potion, and then we're unburdened, I think. Yeah. And see if this... Uh, yeah, dog, right? If he steps on it. Oh, yeah, right. I mean, we do want to pick it back up, label it and stuff. Yeah, the, uh, 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 the dog um, picked it up. Even. Okay. And actually, you know what? Um, do you have it right now? No, so I should pick it up again? So the dog stepped on it, right? Yeah. Okay. Pick it up, name it uncursed. Do you remember how to do that? Yeah. Hash and name. name. Uh, I, what do you want to name? D, uncursed, right? Very good. You have studied well, young grasshopper. <laughs> um, and now I would say uh, just like, I guess we don't, just like near the oracle, drop the wand of locking. It's not very useful. Okay, I walk there um, burdened. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I don't know how far oh, away you are. Use the splashing of a naiad? Na na yeah, that just means there's fountains. And a gnome zombie attacks us. <laughs> okay, kill the gnome zombie. The gnome, the large dog bites the gnome zombie. Then the gnome zombie is destroyed. Wow. Oh, you hit the floating eye. You're floating. Don't do that. You're oh, this might kill us.
Yeah, you are frozen by the floating ice ga gaze. Yeah. You can move again. Wow, you survived it. Congratulations. But we, yeah, we still have to add 72 HP. Yeah, this is a really good noob killer. Oh, yeah? Uh, yeah, because, you know, you run around in the first couple levels, you hit a floating eye, you're paralyzed, a jackal comes and kills you. Oh. Because you're paralyzed. Forever? Um, no. No, but for many, many turns sometimes. Maybe even a hundred. Oh, wow, okay. Uh, it's rough. And, yeah, newbies don't know how to deal with that. You can just um, <laughs> throw all the darts that we just dropped at it. That's one way. I have a better way. Are you standing in front of it? Yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah, hit it's in a the corridor. Yeah. yeah, but you're in front of it, right? Yeah. Hit A for apply. Apply. And now uh, maybe star to look at the inventory. Yeah. What's the letter of the looking glass? Q. <laughs> hit Q. And in, in the direction of the eye. Yes. The floating eye is frozen by what? Really? Yeah, and <laughs> nice. now mash it into pulp. You hit the floating eye. You are frozen by the floating oh, ice really? gaze. Oh, did I just out myself as a noob? And you can move again. <laughs> Try to do that again. I guess... Uh, the dog is standing at our back. Nobody come, can come here. Um, still, you g give it some... Um, I mean, you can freeze it again and then throw daggers at it. That sounds like a good course of action. We don't have... Oh, we have th still the looking glass. Why do we have... St we still have it. Well, why would that use it oh. up? It's just a oh, hand yeah. mirror. Yeah. A Q. It's frozen. Okay. okay. And we throw daggers at it. Yeah. Um, B... Uh, and we have the poison dart. We can throw that at it. Sure. B, N, and L. Um, throw... We throw with T, right? Yeah. B. The dagger hits the floating eye. Throw more. <laughs> uh, N. The poison dart misses. And big L. The elven digger hits the uh, floating eye. Your movements are now unencumbered. Because <laughs> we got rid of all stuff. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, we have nothing else to throw. Shit. Uh, why not zap the wand of magic missile? Oh, wait, what? Um, I, can, I think we can hit it. Because we are in a corridor and on, on, on our back there's our dog. All right, hit it. You kill the floating eye. Nice. Is there a corpse? Yeah. Oh, cool. Eat the corpse. There are several objects here. Eat it? Yeah, I think it gives you telepathy. The floating eye corpse tastes. Okay. <laughs> you stop eating the floating eye corpse. You got interrupted? Oh, yeah. What interrupted you? An iguana. Okay, just kill that thing. I kill it. Ugh. Resume your meal. Gain powers. Yes. You resume Padawan. your meal. You finish eating the floating eye corpse. You feel a strange mental uh, uh, acuity. Ooh, you just gain telepathy. What, what does that do? Uh, well, uh, lots of things. You can sense monsters now in your surroundings. Oh, really? Yes, but here's the problem. You, you, your powers are so subtle, you need to suppress the imprint of your other senses before you gain the full extent of your powers, my young Padawan. <laughs> okay. So we have to find a blindfold or something. Oh, really? And then we can... Wow. And if we put that on, we can... Yeah, like... you see them through walls and stuff. Wow, nice. Okay. I forget if telepathy does anything else, but this is quite cool. That um, was good. I'm glad that didn't kill us. <laughs> there's a slime mold here. Oh, you can. That's food. Pick it up. And a scroll labeled Fall End of Odan. Yeah, I don't know what that is. We you can curse one. identify it if you and want. And ABC, we pick the dagger. The dagger the... and stuff, yeah. I have trouble. Yeah, I have. Yeah, it's our burdening problem. Okay. And th this oh, there's something. There's a U walking around. That's a unicorn. Don't hit that. Find out, do semicolon, find out the alignment of the unicorn. Pick an object. Gray. What's our alignment? Uh, lawful. Okay, I think... Uh, Gray sounds neutral. It is neutral. See if you can kill it, if it's peaceful. I mean, okay, first get unburdened, because the unicorns are a bit tough. Okay, so I drop everything? Or I... Maybe a dagger. I don't know. Just enough. Okay, I... Drop B. Doesn't do anything. Uh, I drop N. I drop the poison dart. Doesn't do anything. Oh my god. Um, should I drop the elven dagger as well? Or the brown potion? How about the wand of locking? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I drop L. 
You, are stra uh, you hear a strange wind. You hear some noises. I don't know what that means, uh, honestly. That's strange. We are still burdened. Oh my god, drop the other dagger. Drop uh, the elven dagger. Yeah. Your movements are now unencumbered. Ugh, how annoying. Okay, find the unicorn. Okay, the gray unicorn butts. The gray yeah. unicorn kicks. The gray unicorn butts. The gray unicorn kicks. Wow. What's your HP? What is it? 63. Off? T 72. Yeah, okay. I hope we can take it. Is the dog helping? Not yet. If I walk, peace, but then uh, it can attack us again, I think. And now, right now you're blocking the dog? Uh, yeah, I think so. Um, I can't walk in the other direction. Yeah, let me do that. Okay. There's the dog, but the unicorn walks away. Come here, unicorn. The unicorn wa wa runs away? Run runs away? What's that? You hit the straw, go the straw golem. The Where did that come from? Just it stand, just sh I don't know. It was right. there suddenly? Well, that's easier to kill. You can kill okay. it first if you, you want. You destroy it. All right. Oh, starting out. The unicorn is gone. Sometimes they teleport. Did you back it into a corner? Uh maybe. Yeah, the straw golem was on the other side. I guess. If you back a unicorn into a corner, it will teleport away for certain reasons. Oh, there it is. Okay. Dog is helping now? Oh, and there's a big... Uh, yeah, the dog can help. And there is big Y. Let me see what this oh, is. Oh, that's a light or something. An ape. Oh, they're also... Don't fight both of them at the same time. Okay. Retreat. The ape might aggro and follow you. The large dog misses the gray unicorn. Oh, the large dog bites the gray unicorn. The gray unicorn misses the large dog. Nice. They can battle it out. That's fine. Shall I help the dog? I mean... Uh, I can't can see the ape at the moment. Then help the dog, sure. Oh, there the ape is. Just don't get too low on HP, that's really all. Okay, so... Um, I don't help the dog. I I can now... I, I don't know if the... Don't fight them both at once. I mean, can you kill the ape first? The unicorn is not so aggressive that it will follow you. You hit the ape. The ape hits, the ape hits, the ape bites. Wow. Oh, d just did five... Five, yeah. eight, five damage. Okay, but you know, do you see how we're on a deeper dungeon level and the monsters are starting to have yeah. multiple attacks and stuff? Yeah. Okay, if I hit, I think I can hit uh, hit once again and then the unicorn is at uh, uh, at us. So okay. You kill the ape. The nice. large dog bites the gray unicorn. The gray, yeah. Yeah, now you can battle the unicorn. This is nice. This might be very good. The Oh, the unicorn attacks us. We have th uh, 39. Hmm. The large dog picks up an eggless. Well, nice. You miss the gray unicorn. The uni gray unicorn misses, misses, and butts. What is butts? It means it kicks you with its hind legs. Ah, okay. The gray unicorn kicks. We have 33 left. I, you kill the gray unicorn. Nice. <laughs> Get the unicorn horn. The large dog eats a gray unicorn corpse. Okay. Yeah, let him have it. You could have eaten the goddamn ape. You see here a, un a unicorn horn. Ah, more burden for us. <laughs> yes, items. That's what we need right now. No, but get that. That's very uh, important. A unicorn horn is part of any ascension kit. Oh, really? Yes. Nice. Because you can apply it to yourself to cure a variety of bad status effects. Okay. Like blindness or confusion uh, and others. Okay, nice. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, we have that. There's an eggless. No, we had that before. We don't want that. No, I don't want that. Did the, the ape drop anything interesting? No. Okay. Shall I eat the ape? Uh, I think you can eat an ape. Is that a humanoid? No, I don't think so, right? An so, ape? And you're a dwarf anyway. You could eat humans. <laughs> really? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, without cannibalism. The ape corpse uh, tastes okay. Yeah, all right. Uh, maybe go back. Oh, there's a, a monkey. Why, why are there monkeys here? Well, maybe it was a little buddy of the ape. The, the you killed his monkeys mother. killed. Okay. Monkeys are annoying because they steal your shit. Like in the zoo. Oh, okay. And so the, I'm back at the... at the Pick up your dagger. want yeah. of logging. Logging. Log <laughs> logging. <laughs> <laughs> it has a protocol of the session. <laughs> log. log wand. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, pick all the cr crap up. Let's just find the upstairs. I don't want to log all the shit around. We can use. Oh, I thought you want me to go to the oracle and drop everything there. Uh, I th I said that when I thought you were right next to it. Uh, since you are not, we can just keep exploring. Find oh, the upstairs. I'm now at the oracle. 
Oh, okay. Then let's drop some stuff here. And by the oh, way... Oh, there's a big F. What's that? Okay. That's a cat, I guess. A violet fungus. Oh, or of course, it's a fungus. I killed that? Yeah, it might make you I hallucinate. It. Yeah. yeah, okay. <laughs> I think only if you eat it. Hallucination is a real thing in this game. Nice. And then there's like uh, monsters walking out that I can't see, that they're not there? Or what? You know, I think I'm going to... Uh, leave that until it happens. <laughs> okay, and then yeah. you can see what hallucinating a net hack means. <laughs> yeah. Um, we can try to identify some of the potions by dipping the unicorn horn into them. Oh, okay. If it's poison or a potion of confusion, it will neutralize it and turn it into water. Okay, so I dropped the potions. All of them? No, th please don't drop them. Let's identify them. Uh, did you ever uh, let the pet step on the brown potion? Yeah. Okay. We did that, yeah. And oh, I forgot you did, and you even named it uncursed, right? Yeah. Okay, so we have a cursed potion, right? Yeah, a sky blue. Potion. Let's dip the unicorn horn into that one. Okay. See what happens. Um, how do <laughs> how do we do? You this? apply it. Oh. Oh, okay. well, actually, I think you just uh, hash dip and then the unicorn horn. Okay. Let me see what the unicorn horn and is and what the cursed potion is called. Unicorn horn is E, and cursed potion is. K. All right. Okay. Hash dip. What do you want to dip? E. Yeah. What do you want to dip the unicorn horn into? K. K. Interesting. Nothing happens. Yes. Nothing happens. Yeah. All right. Do it with the rest of the potions. Okay. That way we can find dip. poison or confusion potions. E. D. Interesting. Okay. Didn't do anything to the brown potion. Yeah. Um, S. T dip S interesting dip T unicorn horn gleams with an oily sheen. Oh, that was a potion of oil, I guess. A potion of oil? Yeah. <laughs> or grease. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> like That's a potion you can have. So oil of oil here for cooking. I call that now a potion okay. of oil. <laughs> Before you make fun of it, do you remember the most terrible trap we have encountered in the Dungeons of Doom? The, the, uh, the trap we fall, uh, fell through? No, I mean the squeaking board trap. <laughs> you could apply ah, your potion of oil to the squeaking nice. board okay. trap. Yeah, I see. Fix it. Which one was it, the oily one? Um, the the, <laughs> the T. T, okay. Well, hash name if it's not identified already. No, it's gone. Oh, it used it up? Yeah. Oh, okay. Do you... Mm -hmm. I hope it identified it automatically. We can see it in the v video later, which one it was. Yeah, that's true, but there's a name a way to name classes of objects in this game, and that would make it easier. But uh -huh, okay. yeah, whatever. That was probably oil, which is also it's useful. You can put that on your bag and stuff, and then it won't get wet and stuff. It oh, has nice. many uses. Yeah, but it's at least, I mean, we unburdened us by one potion now. Did you dip it into all of them? But why don't we have that? Yeah. Huh. No, uh, there's the W and C, the puce and puce and clear potion. Yeah, clear is probably water, but let's do all of them. Um, what W? Interesting. No, nothing okay. happens. And what did I say? C. Um, dip, E, C. Interesting. Nothing happens. Yeah. All right. Um, d let's drop the clear potion here. I think it makes sense to drop potions at the oracle because um, that's where our fountains are, and this is where we could make water potions if we need to. Shall I drop it in the womb where the oracle is? Sure. Okay, what shall I drop? Only the clear po clear potion? Yeah, that one. And check our burdening level. Maybe at this spot, just because it's convenient, we can also drop maybe even both wands, locking and magic missile, because magic missile is not that useful. Okay, L and Z. L. Z. We are not... Um, Burdened. Burdened anymore. All right. And then the let's just keep looking for the upstairs. Okay. And, um, yeah, adventure. I think, so, in Sokoban, on every level, there's going to be a ring and a wand. You know? uh -huh, it's okay. like fat loot. And I want to keep the scroll of identify until we find those. Ah, uh, I see. And then we can use them, I think. Um, do, do we do anything with the statues? No, right? If we have a pickaxe, we can just smash them. Okay. Like we hate art objects. <laughs> uh, and they might contain contain spell books. Oh, wow, nice. Yeah. So we do that for sure when we find it. Absolutely. Okay. There's a house cat in front of us. <laughs> well, I is it, it peaceful? Or bites. I kill it. What's your HP? 
57, 60 now. Oh, okay. That's pretty, fun. that's pretty all right. Yeah, just keep exploring then. You step onto a level teleport trap. Oh, here we go. You are <laughs> momentarily blinded by a flash of light. Um, I'm so we were on six, right? Yeah. And now we are on two again. On two? Yeah. Oh, my God. That's boring. I think it's boring when I teleport you up. It's like if I teleport you down, it's like, oh, my God. This is much harder than I thought. But now... It's like not very oh, interesting. There was a floating eye. Oh yeah, and I killed it. <laughs> it was one, one hit. hit. Good. Stop. Just hit. do you remember the <laughs> letter they have? Is it an E? Yeah, it's an E. Just yeah. don't hit E. <laughs> okay. Yeah. That's another rule. Shall I eat do you remember it? rule number one? Yeah. Uh, don't walk on monies, uh, corpses, co or money, corpses, and gems, gems, or darts. Uh, and now not, rule number two is d don't hit ease. <laughs> okay. Just don't. Shall I eat Very the simple. Carbs? Yeah, right? Well, are you hungry or satiated? No, no. We already ate one. I mean, but yeah, you can eat it just for uh, satiety, for sure. Tastes okay. Yeah. Um, Floating eye must, like, I wonder if that tastes like mushroom. It's weird. Yeah, now the tiles just go down downstairs. <laughs> This is just sort of inconvenient, this level teleport. Hopefully our dog is still there. Um, they usually, like, you get many turns before they untame. Ah, uh, okay. He'll certainly be there. The question is, will he be tame? But, yeah, if we don't lollygag, it should be fine. There's a rock piercer here. I yeah, can okay. kill that. You right? can kill it. Yeah, it's yeah. fine. By the way, everyone, I want to let you know, I got uh, my COVID vaccination shot just today. So if in the process of this netag run I get an anaphylactic shock, then you'll know <laughs> why. If I was I was hit by a poison dart, basically. Yeah. Today. I really uh, there's a uh, really attack the gnome. No, I don't want to attack the gnome. We Which one are the ones here. down? I always what do you mean that. down? Um, the oh, staircase um, down. Uh, the greater than symbol, I think. <laughs> oh yeah, you're yeah, right. I'm pretty yeah. Level three. Okay, that's okay. the one with the shop. Um, greater than, yeah, that's not far. I mean, it's always basically the opposite one of the one that you came out of. Except a lepre leprechaun. A leprechaun. Le oh shit! Oh, don't let you let it hit you. Don't don't attack. Oh him. oh oh oh! Your purse feels lighter. <laughs> yeah, he just steals gold and runs away. Should I run after him? No, it, I mean we only had what seventeen gold. Yeah, now we have nothing. It doesn't matter. Okay, let him have it. Let well, him <laughs> snicker his annoying leprechaun laugh in the corner with his seventeen gold. <laughs> <laughs> okay, the next uh, stairs are. Oh no, I don't know. No, if this is. This is. Dungeon level, level five. Four. Level five, okay. Um, and I don't know if it's the Nomish Mines. No, I don't think so. No, uh, I would see that. Did there. you already pass the level where you have a choice? Yeah, Is I it? think. Uh, okay. On level. What's this? A monkey. You hear the chime of a cash register. Yeah, this side of the shop as well, this level. That's in my notes. Oh, and here's a door that we didn't open. Ah, by, be, that I think might be the shop. Yeah. Yeah. It's closed for inventory, I think. Still? I think it's forever. Oh, really? Oh, okay. Until you bust down the door. Or you can also, uh, strangely enough, if you kick down that door, the shopkeeper will immediately zap you with a wand of death. Mm -hmm. If you <laughs> so dig through the walls with a pickaxe, <laughs> he'll be like, oh, I'm blah, 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 welcome to my shop. Oh, really? Yeah, it's weird. Huh. Or you can also teleport into it. That works as well. They, they are only, uh, they are sitting uh, behind the door and waiting for... Uh, for well, I don't know. They really care about their fucking door. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, maybe it's kind of a politeness thing. I don't know. Okay, I'm on level six again. And? Nice. Find the door. Oh, yeah. It's uh, yeah, it follows us again. Yeah, it's uh, all right. Then let's resume looking for the uh, upstairs. Did you already find the downstairs here? Actually, there is. On Sorry, I'm wrong. It we look for the downstairs. Wait, uh, the floor of a room where there was the trap before that. Yeah. Uh, last time there is no trap now. Oh, maybe it disappeared when you triggered it. It's possible. I'm. I don't know. I see here a whistle. Nice, pick it up. Hopefully that will not burden us. <laughs> no. Remember the letter. And I didn't find the stairs, and I think there's no way to go. There must be stairs down. Literally must be, unless this net hack is broken. 
Um, either there, I mean, if you look at the map, does it look like there is like Terra Incognita? Or... Oh, I found it already. Yeah, a long oh, time okay. ago. Sorry. Okay, then. Oh, we are hungry. All right. Shall we? What's the uh, turn? Seventeen uh, seven thousand seven hundred forty-six. Uh, we could try waiting until we're um, weak and then pray. Yeah, let's do that. All right. I don't think we have much food anyway. I think if we find corpses, we can still eat them. Okay, I'm on the stairs now. Do I go down? Is your dog adjacent to you? Yes. Then go down, my knight. You descend the to stairs. To remember, we have Excalibur. We're like we're someone now. After we found a useless artifact and sold it. <laughs> <laughs> Here's a large box and a lamp. <laughs> Oh, oh, a lamp? Yeah. Oh, shit. Pick, pick, I mean, curse identifier. <laughs> oh, I don't have to pick it up, right? Oh, the dog walks onto it. Yeah, okay, pick it up. Nice. You have a little, laugh, li li a little trouble lifting. Yeah, but we don't want to drop that, and the reason for that is that it might be a magic lamp. Um, turn it on. How do, how do I do that? Uh, apply the lamp. Okay, apply... Uh... Uh, lamp G, A G. The la your lamp is now on. Okay. If it doesn't run out, it's magic, and we're on our way to a wish. Okay. Okay. What do What does a wish do? Uh, we can wish for anything. Basically, no. yeah. Really? You can wish for any object. Like for for God mode. Uh, for any object. No okay. objects. Like, can we wish our dog back <laughs> if we lose it? Oh, we can wish mm. for a pickaxe and go through the wall to the gnomish mines. <laughs> uh, you're um, technically correct, but stupid. <laughs> that is not something you wish for. Okay, we wish for Excalibur 2 or something. Um, what we wish for depends a lot on the situation we are in when we have the ability to wish. And I will... Um, begin a larger discussion of wishing when we are in that situation. Okay. Um, there's a box. Shall I try to open it? Uh, untrap it first. With O. Oh, no, with I think U. U was the key. You know of no traps there. <laughs> <laughs> like it does that, not so. mean anything for us. <laughs> yeah. yeah, then now just step on the space and hash loot, I guess. You see, hash loot. There's a large box here. Loot it? Yes. Yeah. Hmm. It turns out to be locked. Oh. Uh, open. Yeah, try open. Hmm, if I, I try to open it, it says, there's a large box here, loot it. Yes, mm, and it's, it's locked. locked. Well, you either need to key or you need to, like, you can, like, kick it and force the lock, but you break stuff that's inside. Oh, well then. Um, yeah, or a wand of opening, I think that exists. Oh, really? Like, maybe we take our wand of locking and... <laughs> oh, we don't have it. <laughs> but that locks... the other um, way around. No, it doesn't work. Although, what we can do is... Um, we have two wands, right? That we... I mean, I think we already tried to identify them with Elbereth. We only have a, a zinc wand named. That's Duncan. unidentified? Yeah. Oh, okay, yeah. If we find a corpse and a doorway, we can do that identification again with ah, this box. Yeah, I see. And it yeah. might be opening. Ah, okay. And what do we do drop for 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 being? Oh, we're burned, again? right? Yeah. yeah, because of the lamp. It's getting tough. I want to keep the lamp for sure. We can drop some potions. <sighs> or mean, we have like a scroll labeled Etoin Shrilu. We have twice. Yeah, but if it's but that really doesn't useful, weigh much. It's just a piece of paper. Uh, oh, yeah, I see. And a slime mold or carrot? You can eat stuff, I guess. Eat those. Eat your stuff, so you you weigh less. <laughs> okay. <laughs> E that makes no sense. X. The carrot is delicious, and we are still burdened. And E and the slime mold. Mmm, that was a yummy slime mold. <laughs> That's so but disgusting. we're still burned. <laughs> still burned? Yeah. Crap. Drop the tinning. Oh, kit. there's a newt. I, I eat the newt. Okay. It tastes okay. It tastes okay. You hear a crashing walk. Now. You finish eating the newt. Uh, I, I um, Drop the tin tinning kit. That's not super necessary and probably weighs a lot. Um, where is it? Uh, tinning kit A. Okay, drop A. Movements are now unencumbered. Whew, yeah, rather have a magic lamp than a tinning kit. Sorry. What does the tinning kit do? You can just uh, take corpses and make them um, sort of not go bad. 
Oh wow, really? Yeah, and then you you run around with a tin of that meat. Uh, but the thing is, you oh, do this. I see. This yeah. is a very important item because you do this. If you do this with corpses that are poisonous, uh, they become non-poisonous. Ah, right? It removes okay. bad effects. Yeah. And that's very useful if you want to eat something um, that is poisonous because it might give you poison resistance. And you can also eat other stuff that oh, will so normally kill you. Oh, so you can eat you. something poisonous, but it's still like poisonous, but doesn't give you doesn't poison you anymore. Well, it still gives you the intrinsic of poison resistance, but doesn't poison you anymore. Ah, okay. So tinning kit is really nice. If on this level we find a poisonous corpse, probably should have looked out for this before, then we can maybe use it. But other than that, I think we have other stuff to do right now. We are in a room where there's a large box, yeah, some food rations, some gold pieces, and a statue of a homun homunculus. Wow, so much stuff. Yeah. Food ration I like. Let's pick that up and loot the box. Two food rations. Two, wow. And the dog, dog drops, dropped something? Oh, the dog, the dog bought the uh, bought the um, uh, box, the other box here. Okay, the other box. Yeah, so or from the other room. Right. And um, so, what do we do with the money? Untrap before so the money. You mean the box? No, there's money here, right? The gold pieces. Uh, just search in front of that square. A couple times. You have Excalibur. It's probably no trap if you search a couple times. Yeah, I don't think so. Yeah. And the statue? Yeah, leave it alone. We can't do anything with it. And the large box we untrap, right? Yeah, and try to open. No traps. Open. Okay. Anything in it? Mm, it turns out to be locked. Oh, man. I'd really like to have an open box. Maybe we should kick it down <laughs> like an angry dwarf. Oh, yeah? Shall we kick it? Well, here's the <laughs> yeah, thing. Yeah, we are angry dwarf. Here's the thing. If we have a box, that's also a cool stash to just put items in because then monsters won't pick them up so easily. Oh, okay, yeah. So, yeah, kick the shit out of this box. I don't care anymore. Kick. Yeah, third. You hear a muffled shatter. Yeah. Okay, now it's I mean, opened. No, keep, 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 I'm sorry, keep kicking. Oh, okay. Hash, kick, third. Okay, again. Kick, third. Again, kick, third. Nothing happens. There's still the large box. Or shall I stand on the box? No. no, in front of it. I think kicking can open a box. Or maybe I'm wrong. Kick, third. You break open the lock. Nice. Oh, yeah. Okay, now open it. Sometimes you shatter just like glass or potions. You carefully open the large box. There, look, take something out, right? Yeah. A melon. <laughs> cool. <laughs> it's like a mushed up melon now because you kicked the shit out of this box. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay, yeah, nice. Okay, nice. Um, we just said the same thing. <laughs> uh, take Now, please uh, go back, go to my precious tinning kit, pick it up, uh, and yeah. then we'll just put it in this box. Maybe along with some boring looking potions. I don't know. And I'm going to take a note that we have a stash here. Oh, I need to put this in my ear. This is level seven, right? Um, Put in that, that no, stash something. Stash one item into the large box. Put something in. Put, put in. something in. Yeah. Yeah. What do you want to stash? Oh, shit. Um, The tinning kit. A. Yeah. Okay. Uh, anything else? Maybe. Do we have any wands we don't want? You have a zinc wand? That's the only one? Okay, never mind. And four potions still. Yeah. Do we? That's the question, all right. Do we carry the potions around? Yeah. I, d I think I, w I won't. If you say there's a wing and a wand on yeah. every level. The thing is, we can like clear out Sokoban, get all that stuff, and then maybe come back and pick up the potions and then identify. If we, the thing is, you can sometimes get an identify scroll that will identify your whole inventory. Oh, yeah. Right, and the chance is higher if you have a blessed scroll, but you can also get lucky on an uncursed one, and that's why you know you want to make that count. Yeah. Uh, but also, but yeah, we, we, yeah, I think it's time to store some potions here. That seems fine. To we me. can get, yeah, we can get back and p p pick anything up any time, right? Yeah. Okay. So I store D, K, S, and W. Yeah. Stash with bunch of potions is what I'm gonna write down. Uh, and a tinning kit. That's nice. That this seems this seems like a good idea. 
This was a good move. <laughs> um, potions. Auto select all the potions. Yes. D, K, S, and W. Nice. Yeah. Okay. Done. Now we. Uh, what? I think. I think our dog picked up the box. Yeah. <laughs> oh no. And dropped it again. <laughs> okay. Well, let's get out of the There's room. There's a locked door. All right. Yeah, can't do anything. Should I kick it? You can open it. No, it doesn't. It's locked. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah, I'll kick it. Actually, is it at the end of a corridor? No. Okay, kick it. Bam! Again. As you kick, the door it opens. Nice. Oh, there's money here. And a gem on the, door, on the floor. Oh, do you know what to do? <laughs> oh, the dog... Walked on the on the jam. Yeah, it's probably safe. Oh, it's not a jam. It's eight rocks, and nah. some gold pieces embedded in stone. What? I've. Uh, I don't understand. Shall I walk on it? Embedded in stone. Yeah. What does that mean? I don't know. Maybe it's in stones because it's a walk trap. Uh, okay, walk on it. I can't. It's okay. Can you semicolon on that square? Yeah, it says twenty nine gold. gold pieces embedded in stone. I guess I've never seen that or forgot about it. Maybe if you have a pickaxe, you can like mine oh, it. Oh, yeah. yeah. Funny. Okay, I found the... Um, I found the... Upstairs? Upstairs. That's Sokoban. We could go there now. Do you want to go to Sokoban? Um, shall we first look at all the... The, re the rest of the level? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Stop. The large dogs is in the way. Yeah, that looks very strange here. What do you mean? The level layout is... Kind of strange. There's an H. That's a human. Really attack the dwarf lord. No. Oh. oh, the dog and the <laughs> dwarf lord are fighting. Yeah, that's good. If he kills it, we might get some better equipment. Is your lamp still on? Oh, let me have his... The lad, the dwarf lord is killed. Nice. Nice. Check his loot. Good dog. A pair of iron shoes, dwarvish short sword, dwarvish mattock, and dwarvish iron helm. See if the dog walks on that whole square. Yeah, he did, and ate the ate the oh. corpse. <laughs> nice. Good <laughs> dog. Uh, yeah. Um, try out the boots and the helm if they're better than the ones you have. This is a bit tedious, but this is sort of the efficient thing to do. Because you will find equipment um, just from mobs that is up to um, plus three in enchantment level. Oh, okay. So I just W, right? Wear them? Uh, yeah, I think it was wear and T, large T for takeoff, capital T. Oh, I had to have to do that first. That's so stupid, I think. Why do why Interestingly, do we found out, right, that you don't have to do that for wielding weapons. It sort oh, of expects yeah. you to always wield a weapon and it will yeah. like just switch it out. It doesn't do it for clothes. I can sort of see why. Because it's like you might accidentally undress stuff that you don't want to undress that's protecting you. Uh. It would be really embarrassing to be floating above Medusa's lake and then accidentally take off your boots of levitation because yeah. yeah, you sure. want to yeah. try on a pair of iron <laughs> dwarf shoes. <laughs> w... And try to remember the... What? The oh, I, 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 I am wielding now <laughs> <laughs> a Dwarvish Iron Helm. You think that's better than Excalibur? No. That's a silly thing to wear. What? <laughs> huh? It says now Dwarvish Iron Helm. Dwarvish Iron Helm is weapon in hand. Yeah. And if I Wield Excalibur. Wield A. Oh, yeah. Okay. And what do you want to wear? Oh. It's plus zero. All right. You can either keep it... Both is plus zero, yeah. I dropped the orcish helm and the iron shoes. Yeah. They're, I think, otherwise pretty much interchangeable. H and D. Oh, and you can see your armor class. What is it? Um, minus five. Yeah. That, I think, was the same as before. So, all right. 
Okay. Keep exploring. Maybe I, it would be really cool if we found an altar on some level. That would be very nice. And um, I think maybe really feeling this vaccine and I think maybe next time we, sh we should play like the, the Windows version of NetHack. <laughs> yeah, finally, right? <laughs> yeah, <I'm> just, <laughs> Not this. why did we never use Microsoft products? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm feeling so lightheaded all of a sudden. Oh, I'm killing coyotes everywhere. <laughs> um, oh, there's an L. What does that do? Is that a leprechaun? I think it sleeps maybe here. Yeah. Can you semicolon it? Yeah, it's a leper gnome. A leper gnome? No, no, how do you call it? That? That's a hard, wrong game, man. <laughs> how do you call it? <laughs> Is it a one mana, one two? <laughs> okay, oh, it, it uh, woke up. It follows us now. I'm walking away. The, the... So is it a leprechaun? Oh, yeah. Okay, you have no money, right? It's 13 gold pieces. Drop the gold. Oh, really? They don't pick it up? Uh, they might, but like the thing is, if he can steal from your purse, he, 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 he then he can teleport. If he can't oh, we do are that, we're weak now. Oh, well, we should watch out and eat. But now you have a leprechaun, a hungry, hungry leprechaun in front of you. No, it, it's uh, in. Uh, I walked away, and it's in the other room. Okay. Um, we have food rations, but we sh we could also pray. Yeah, shall we pray? I, is there any reason why we might have negative luck? Can you think of any? We never mm, broke a mirror or anything. No, we did not. Never did we do anything. Actually, bad. that's not true. Because you kicked that box. Oh, that's that's something bad, really. Well, something shattered in there, right? Oh yeah. That could have been a mirror. Oh this yeah. This is how you play net hack. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh yeah, you're right. Right, yeah. and breaking a mirror will give you a serious luck penalty. Okay. And if you pray with negative luck, you will get smited. And then we're dead. No. No, but uh, you can. It's not unwinnable then it's just tedious because then uh, your god will be angry with you and you can't pray anymore but uh, okay but for how long is our uh, is our luck that bad then that's a bit random i don't know but there are ways to find out if you have negative luck but i would just wait like maybe a thousand turns and it'll probably be fine the thing is we have alternatives right we have food rations yeah we found two but yeah. we don't know if they are um and we have a melon oh, they're fine just eat them eat a food ration really but we no, don't know if they are uncursed or cursed i actually i I've never seen that be relevant with food, honestly. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah, I'm not, it, I think if it's cursed, it's slightly more likely to be rotten. Bleach, rotten food there to finish eating the uh, yeah, food ration. Yeah, but I don't quite know what the even the, the consequence of this is, except I guess it gives you less nu nutrition. The point is, though, you're probably no longer weak, right? Yeah, we are not. Okay. Now face the leprechaun. You hit the leprechaun. The leprechaun reads <laughs> you keep... a scroll labeled Lorem Ipsum. Oh, wow. what does it do? You hit the pony. It summoned a pony. Oh, that was a scroll of summon monster, I guess. You kill the pony. Okay, we get this lip hook. What, what a wizarding uh, leprechaun. I've never seen that. Are you I kill are you, it. You keep calling it a leper gnome, by the way. Yeah, I, that's is how it? I learned it. <laughs> but it's a leprechaun, right? Well, the mountain nymph drinks a pink potion. Holy shit, the mountain what's nymphs, going on? Uh, I think the, the, the le le lepre... How do you call them? A leprechaun. Lepre the know, leprechaun. Top of the morning, good sir. <laughs> the, the leprechaun summoned something, I think, again. Oh, I don't know. And that now there's a mountain nymph. Yeah, don't hit her. Why? Oh, they suck. Okay, they will seduce you, oh. and they steal your shit. But is it she? Is she adjacent to you? Yeah. All right. Uh, so get out that mirror again. Hold up that looking glass to her. Oh, apply. Yeah. Um. Apply. Q. The no mummy ignores her reflection. The no no oh, mummy. Oh, okay. Hits. Oh, uh, yep. as you do, you maybe have a status effect that says "halu." No, but th she drank a potion, and then there's it said a um, sh uh, pink potion, by the way, and, and she then it said she um, transformed. She that was mutated. a potion of polymorph, I guess. And now she's a no mummy. Mummy, we can kill that. <laughs> well, right? it's very silly, Renee, to hold up a looking glass to a no mummy. <laughs> Why would you do that? <laughs> Just kill that no mummy. I hit it. It hits. The large dog eats leprechaun. Lepo lepo no! It does? Yeah, the oh, corpse. Oh, shit. Do we need that? No. Uh, leprechaun corpses can give you teleportitis. Oh, wow. Now you might have a teleportiting dog. <laughs> oh. That's just a bit annoying. And there's a looking glass and a cloudy potion here. Yeah, that's cool. Did the looking glass shatter? No, obviously say, not. No. Okay. 
Um, leave the looking glass. We already have one. But get the potion. Oh, and there's 69 gold pieces. Nice. What's your HP? Um, six, 70. Um, that potion might contain a genie, by the way. Cloudy potions often do that. Oh, and the lamp is still lit. That's a good sign. Um, we have to bless it, though, before we rub it. Um, can you curse identify that potion? Sure. Before yeah. we keep going. Yeah, the dog walks. Okay, into. just pick it up. Hash name it on cursed. This has been s sort of more stressful. I f I re can really feel us being in deeper levels. Yeah, yeah. Of the um, dungeons because of doom. Because they, they, yeah, they have they are stronger, have more attacks, and they do stuff like drinking. Yeah, it's more interesting stuff and yeah. summoning ponies. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, I. Pick up my 13 gold pieces. We have now 83 gold pieces. Yeah. And I walk down the. Oh, sh oh. No, we want to go up. But you can take a quick up. peek downstairs for sure. Up? I, I thought we want to go to uh, Zokoban. That's up. Did you notice that there are two upstairs on this level? Oh, yeah, you're right. Yeah, and yeah. no downstairs. Uh, uh, there should like, be a downstairs as well. Uh, at least I found no none. Oh, okay. I thought you just were at the downstairs. No, I was at the upstairs. I was. Okay. The Roth, there are four Roth here. Are you in Zokuban? No. Okay. Um, uh, for, careful, they I, can swarm you. I kill it and I kill it. Yeah, remember these are the. Stupid... There's some graffiti on the floor here. You read, all oh, we real wizards can write scrolls. Uh, is this in front of a wall? Yeah. Okay, is there a door? N no. no, it's in front of a wall. Okay, search a couple times. Wait, there, I still have to kill, kill the, the Roth. Roth. Oh, those annoying underground sheep. I hit it. Meh. <laughs> I kill it. Okay, shall I eat any of them? Yeah, they're just good nutrition. It's actually pretty tasty, probably. They're just watch that you're not satiated. Okay, so I'm standing in front where you eat all the there's Roth. the graffiti, yeah. Okay, just search a couple times. Might be a closet. No, behind that there's a um, there's a uh, there's a um, how do you call it a corridor. I was Be on the other side of the wall, and on the other side of the wall is a corridor. Okay. Oh, I see. But yeah. Okay. Um, then not. Yeah. I wasn't sure what it says. There's a certain inscription. I forget exactly where it is. But if that's in front of a closet, which may be hidden and trapped. Um, then in that, the, actually, the trap in that closet will be a teleporter to a vault. Oh wow! Okay. Yeah, and this might have been one. And That's shall we not. put anything like the cloudy potion? Shall we put that in the? I would kind of like to hang on to that because it might have a genie in it that can also give us wishes. Oh, okay. So, so we don't put it in the in the box. No, I mean we're doing fairly okay on the burdening level, I think. Okay, so I go up now. Well, do we do want to do that next time? Uh huh. Tease oh it. yeah. I think we're at about time. Then let me let me have a look for the maybe I find the yeah I think before we go to Sokoban we'll probably do that next time and maybe you can explore the rest of this level and maybe find the downstairs yeah but that's a good thing to have oh there there's a way yeah there's another potion a white potion man we have so many potions the dog wa walks onto it picks it up yeah pick it up name it on cursed white potion seven gold pieces. By the way, it never happened that uh, I walked onto money and it was a trap. That's true. And now you, you're you're saying I'm a liar. I'm full of shit. Is that what you're saying? <laughs> that <laughs> I'm a bad teacher? Listen, I'm going to teach okay. you a lesson. Okay, Marius. There, there are some <laughs> there, there are some dollars here, right? Let yeah, that be the proving point. Search a couple I, times. I walk onto it. Five gold pieces. Nothing yeah, but else. like a anecdote is not data. It's <laughs> Or something. Oh, there's a locked door. Should I kick it open? Oh, no, it's at the <laughs> oh, end of the corridor. Oh, why don't you just stab yourself <laughs> on your Excalibur and then eat a leprechaun while looking at a flo floating eye or something? I don't know. It's, it's like it's you're, you're superstitious, maybe. Oh, what's this? This is a game a of where risk. jackal changes into a jackal. <laughs> oh, holy shit. It's stupid. I killed the jackal. <laughs> don't eat that corpse. Welcome to Experience Level 7. You feel up. quick. Oh, that's cool. We got some dexterity, I think. Yeah, that can... Oh no! Or it might be a speed upgrade, which is also great. 
but what are our stats by the way um so i don't kick open the door okay there's a door there right at the end of a corridor yeah at the end at the end of a corridor we don't want to kick it open but can you just o open it does that work oh wait no the door's locked crap is there another way in no there was no graffiti in front of this door no but i uh, but we found the way down Oh, we so, do? Yeah. Okay, then we don't need to so go. We don't have door. to go there. I mean, the thing is, I don't Oops. think there's a shop here because there was no uh, message. Cash like, would register yeah. anything, right? So it's probably not, but we don't have to risk it just yet. There's yeah. just no reason. But you can pop uh, down just to, you know, already locate the upstairs of the lower level. I pop, I go down? Yeah, I go down ah. and just look and immediately go back up again. You descend the stairs. There's an O here. What's this? An orc? A goblin. 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 Okay, I go up again. Yeah. All right. Okay. I think... Um, I, um, you want to hear this, our stats? Yeah, please. Okay. That's a good way to close it out. So, we are... You are Marius the Fighter. We are on dungeon level 7. You have 95 gold. We have 78 HP. Power level... Or pa pa power That's level? just mana. Let's face it. It's mana. It's 13. AC is minus 5. XP is 7. And you have... 13 strengths, 14 dexterity, 19 con, 7 int, 9 wisdom, 11 charisma, and you are lawful. Yeah, that's the thing. We have weirdly low strength. Uh, it'll train over time. I oh, guess. yeah. We have a lot of con. Yeah. Yeah, which is great. It's also just the profile of a dwarf. Uh, more con mm. than strength, but that's yeah. We, if we increase strength a little bit, maybe if we find a boulder, we can just actually, you know what? We're going to Sokoban, we'll be pushing boulders all the time, <laughs> so that's great exercise for our little dwarven lady. Yeah, um, that's great. I'm gonna also note down that we gained the intrinsic of telepathy this run. Oh, yeah, that was cool. Yeah, we need to blindfold. Yeah, and we just got lots of stuff. We found a unicorn horn, that's great. This yeah. was successful, even though there was no big narrative, but we just of explored rooms yeah but now we're directly in front of Sokoban I'm excited to puzzle our way through that and by puzzle I mean cheat um, <laughs> <laughs> that's my favorite kind of puzzle yeah yeah <laughs> well, good times uh, and um, yeah I guess thank you Renee for um, enduring me once more and to listening to my teachings yeah thank you for, <laughs> thank you for your stories and um yeah, I'm still curious if the money thing is real, but I believe right, you. Right, right. Yeah, maybe if you viewers want to chime in, get it, chime, uh, <laughs> and comment on whether <laughs> Traps on Dollars is real, uh, you can leave a comment. You can also follow us on Twitter, at makes underscore play, and you can subscribe to the channel. We are always happy for more subscribers. And until next time, bye. Ciao.